careful, Corvo. They call her Granny Rags. You wouldn't recognize her real name, or even the name of her family, but an emperor begged for her hand once, and rich young men fought each other for her favor. I watched her consider them all, measure their worth, and find them wanting. Then, she made a different choice. You're on your way to face the High Overseer, the leader of a great cult dedicated to loathing me. What will you do, I wonder? Let's check Granny Rags out. Little booties are sad today. Dear? Is that you, my dear husband? No. I, my eyes aren't what they used to be. Have you seen my little birdies? Ah, oh, the dear things must be starving without their granny. Here, birdies. The little birdies she's referring Here. to are rats. Oh, my, my, my. I think I have gentlemen callers again, but not the way I used to, not the nice ones. I hear them, and they're not very polite ones either. Granny Rags, Granny Rags, let us in. Ah, oh, well, they'll go away again if they know what's good for them. But what a bother. Here's the key to the front door, love. You'll see to those ruffians, won't you? Yeah, I guess we can handle this situation. Those combat darts make all the difference in the world. Okay, guys. Now, another thing about these bodies. Remember, we got plague rats all over the place. And hungry ones. You gotta be careful where you put these bodies. It'll disappear on you. And you'll get ch uh, charged with a death. Which raises your... Your, uh... Your level of chaos. From low to high. Help me with those ill-mannered boys. My brave man. Listen, Granny has a birthday present for you. I got it from the outsider, and now I'm giving it to you. Go on. It's upstairs. On the vanity. I think you'll cut a nice figure with it. Remember how we used to dance? Our parties were even grander than those at the Boyle Manor. Everyone wanted to come. Boy, this woman is a trip. I told you the knives go on. I hope you like the little gift I got for you. It's the least I could do for turning those louts away. I can't bear these Bottle Street children. Ruffians, every last one of them. Rotten apples. And that slack jaw is the worst of you know what I just thought of? Make sure you get you a good look at her face. Else for me. Another little favor. And I'd give you another present. Another lovely rune carved from the bones of a dead whale. Do you remember my doctor, dear? Dr. Galvani? And now the there is hair. a clever man. He's got all sorts of nasty rat guts and disease in his laboratory. Wouldn't it be a shame if some of that mess Found its way into the Bottle Street Gang's elixir still. That'd teach me. See to it, dear. I'll find you another present just like the first. Galvani lives on Clavering Boulevard. Or at least he used to. Those were the days. Now run off. My baby birdies are hungry. So precious. Hmm. Okay, let's get to business here.
Now you can do what she wants you to do, or you can ignore it. That's not what we heard. It was just a cold. Are you sure? <laughs> You're out. I owe you, brother. I won't ask about the mask. I wouldn't want my face seen either pulling a stunt like that. You know what? I'll return the favor. Come by Griff's shop. That's my business. Well, it was, at one time. But now I'm reduced to scavenging things from here and there as the city dies. If you need anything, I wouldn't mind trading for a little money. Maybe someday the plague will blow over and everything will go back to normal. But until then, it's scavenging for me. Griff is a unique character. If you don't rescue him from these guys here, he'll turn into a weeper. But he got he uh, he has stuff that we need, so we're going to use him. And he comes in real handy. And you, you go out here and feed the rats. Well, that's something we can't use. Now, if you didn't have that uh, void challenge, you wouldn't have been able to. Do, I wouldn't have been able to do that. Now, I'm going to go ahead and right now and upgrade my blink. So I got four. So I'll upgrade that. I got what one left? Yeah. And let's get some health going here. We'll be back for those. Those darts. See, with that added uh, power, we can jump further. You stop moving. What's a lock on his helmet? Neither were you. We just spent four darts for 50 bucks. I guess now we need those darts, huh? Now nah, let's get over here and uh this place over here. Usually I would just ignore this place because I am not about to poison uh, uh, Slack Jaw's whiskey deal because we're trying to fight the plague. That's why the Empress is dead. And I'm not going to help her fulfill her plans. You know, the thuggies I don't mind taking care of, you know. But, you know, to intentionally poison and, 
and uh, and kill or maim people? No. Now, if I was going for a high chaos run, then yeah, oh, by all means, I would do that. But we're not going for a high chaos, so we don't really need the bone charm she's offering us. We'll just have to get by without it. Combination of this safe is two eight seven. Come on. Wait, did you touch the door handle to Dr. Galvani's lab? Yeah, I think so. Then you Someone help me out! Good night. Now if I didn't have combat darts, he would have put a hurting on me with that that swing of his. Since we're not coming back this way, I better go ahead and get that now. Now, you can go downstairs and wreak havoc if you want, but I'm not going to. I mean, there's really nothing down there. It's at three guards. And some very hungry rats. All right. To discover the combination of that safe in this book, if you'll see the 28th day of the seventh month, well, there's three numbers there, 287. And that's your combination to the safe. Now we're going upstairs. We don't really need our weapons up here, so we'll just, well, except for getting these spring razors. I love these things, man. You're going to play with me now, aren't you? Yeah, I love these spring razors. They come in real handy. Now there's the uh, the rat guts or rat versera that she wants us to put into his whiskey. Well, we're not going to do that. We're going to go on about our mission here. I'm going to leave that unlocked. When we come back next time, there'll be a bone charm there instead of the uh, the rat thing. Guts. Come on, Lo Sane, don't take that long. We're just going outside, that's all. Okie dokie now. Now most of the time I will just drop down to the alley and go take out those guys. We have 25 coin on them in the alley. But I'm not going to do that. Everybody else does that. I want to be different my gameplay. Come here.
think there's a little bit of money here. Yes, our jumping distance is quite considerably considerable. Good deal. second day is when the skin really starts to come all the way off. Is that true? Or is it the itching that really... 